Meditation three, seven rainbow rings. Begin by sitting in your comfortable meditation pose with a nice straight spine. Alternatively, lie down in Savanasa pose with your spine lying on the floor. When you allow your spine to be straight, you're allowing the vertebrae to gently separate, which allows the discs to be able to release and pump back up. Take a few deep breaths. Three deep inhalations and exhalations. As you let go of the practice, let go of the day, let go of anything that you feel you need to do because this is your time to energize and revitalize, to restore and to heal. Close your eyes and let go of your surroundings. Allow your eyeballs to roll back into the base of the sockets, looking up through the crown center. Allow your lips to be gently closed, but your lower jaw can drop back and down, away from the upper jaw. Let the tongue sink back into the base of the throat center with just the tip of the tongue resting on the roof of the mouth behind the upper teeth. Relax your cheeks. Relax your ears. Relax your forehead. Relax your hairline. Feel as though the whole of your head is melting like tripping wax. Relax your neck, relax your throat center, relax your shoulders, if you are in a sitting position, your hands are gently going to rest in your lap or on your thighs, with your hands turned over, the backs of the hands in contact with your body, the palms of your hands facing up to the ceiling. If you are lying down, allow your arms to be greater than shoulder distance apart away from your torso, elbows, wrists and palms facing the ceiling, backs of the hands to the floor, fingers gently curled. And 
And if you're lying down, allow your legs to be slightly greater than hip distance apart. The thighs rolled out, the knees rolled out, the calves and the ankles a gentle extension of that straight leg. Heels to the floor, feet gently turned out to the corners of the mat. Relax your chest, relax your upper back, relax your abdominals, allow all your internal organs to gently relax and find their space within your body. Relax your lower back. Relax your pelvis. Relax all the way down your arms. With each exhalation, you're sinking into the mat. Whatever part of your body is resting on the mat, let it sink in as if creating an impression in wet clay. Relax your thighs. Relax your knees. Soften and let go of any tension in the muscles. Relax your ankle joints. Bring a softness to the soles of the feet. Relax all ten. Scan your body for any signs of tension. And breathe in. And as you exhale, let that tension drift away from your body like smoke on a frankincense burner. Just releasing swirling away. Now imagine that right above your forehead is a circle of light, almost like a circle of sun. White light can be refracted into all colors of the rainbow. So imagine now that that beautiful circle of white healing light is going to release a ring of red. Allow this circle of red healing light to travel down, to circle around your crown, to circle around your eyes, to keep circling and swirling around your neck. Imagine it like a big hoop 
circling around your shoulders, your upper back, your chest, circling and vibrating its healing energy as this wonderful red light circles around your torso. And this color, this beautiful red light is going to rest in the Muladhara, the root center, which is at the base of the torso, pulsing and vibrating its wonderful energy. Let it rest there. As you gaze back up and look as the light releases a second ring of orange healing light. Let this the sacral area, the lower abdominals. Allow it to vibrate and pulsate and share its incredible healing capabilities. The red circle recharges the root center, the root chakra, replenishing its energy, restoring it to its full light capacity. The orange light recharging and energizing the sacral area. Look up as you see a third ring coming away from the white healing light, a beautiful sunshine yellow, a beautiful happy daffodil yellow, bright and light. Allow it to circle around the crown center around the throat center, moving down to the heart center. This yellow light is going to rest in Manipura, the solar plexus, the upper abdominals, just above your belly button. The red ring circling around the root, the orange ring circling around the sacral area, the third ring circling around the solar plexus. Look up as you see a fourth ring a beautiful fresh leaf green, like a brand new leaf that's budding out and making its hopeful way in spring. New life, new growth, regenerated, restored, revitalized. This wonderful green healing energy circles around your body, 
circling around the crown center, the throat center, and making its way to the heart center, Anahata. The red ring circling around the root, the orange ring circling around the sacral, the third ring circling around the solar plexus and the fourth ring circling around the heart center. And as you look up you see a fifth ring, a light blue, like a bright blue summer sky, like the blue of a clean swimming pool. This is going to circle down your body to Vishwada, the throat center. And look up, you see a sixth ring, a dark blue, like an indigo blue. like a fresh pair of new denim jeans. This is going to circle down, going to your third eye, your ajna, around your forehead, look up, This is going to come down and rest at Sakharasa, the crown center. Feel all of these rings circling around your body. Your body instinctively knows which color it needs the most of in order to restore and balance and heal. So allow your body to choose from the wonderful rainbow palette. All of the chakra centers spinning like cogs, working in unison to recreate complete healing, restoration, rejuvenation of your mind, your body, your heart and your spirit. These wonderful colors emitting wonderful healing energy. And when you feel that your body is fully restored, you're going to then allow these rings to gently be absorbed into the body. Shrink them all down into a wonderful ball of light. And allow that wonderful rainbow ball of light to shrink and shrink until it is so small it can rest in the folds of your heart center like a battery of energy 
that you can draw upon at any time. But for now, let it rest in your heart center. Take a few breaths and thank your body for its ability to heal and restore. Thank your body for its ability to support you, to carry you through life. So many of us beat up on our bodies. Some of us can be mean to our bodies abusing our bodies, filling it with too much alcohol, too many toxins, too much stress, or abusive words when it doesn't look or move the way we want it to. But our bodies are a vessel to carry us through life a wonderful, amazing vessel. It really is time we learn to value our bodies, appreciate our bodies, and love our bodies. Because they do support us. Take a few deep breaths now, allowing the breath to bring back the connection and awareness. And if you're lying down, you're going to wriggle your fingers and wriggle your toes and rotate your ankles and rotate your wrists. And if you're sitting, you're going to wriggle your fingers and toes, rotate your ankles and rotate your wrists. And then if you're lying down, you're going to stretch as much as you can, being very mindful of the lower back. And then roll over to your right side, using your hands as a pillow as you take a couple more breaths. Keeping your eyes closed, you're then going to bring yourself up into a seated position. Rub the palms of your hands together to create a wonderful warmth. And when your palms feel nice and warm, you're going to place these hands over your closed eyes. Then open your eyes in this beautiful safe place. Take a lovely deep breath. As you gently remove the hands, so that the day comes back in, in a gentle, mild way. A day that you are fully ready to face. Namaste, my soul, deeply honors and recognizes your soul.